Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to texture your own weapon for Fallout 3 or Fallout New Vegas. So what you, what you want to do first is open up Fallout Mod Manager for whichever game you're doing it for. Hit OK. Head over to Tools, BSA, oh, Browser. And then click Open. Scroll to your Common folder in Steam. And then Fallout 3 or Fallout New Vegas. Do your data. And then just click on Textures 2 if you're doing it for a weapon. Then what you want to do is just hit Extract. But I've already got it so I'm not going to do that. So we'll just close it like that, then open up your FNB textures, or it should be in a folder just called textures, then hit weapons, and then just browse for the weapon that you want to edit. I myself am going to edit a 10mm pistol, so here it is here, and I'm going to use GIMP to edit it. Make sure you untick load mip maps, and then just edit it. Do whatever you want. I'm going to use a spray gun and choose blue just for the hell of it. I'm zooming in and out by holding control and scrolling the mouse wheel in case you're wondering and I'll just put hey. There you go. And file save as. I'll save it to my desktop and I'll call it custom pistol. Hit save. Now you want to click on generate maps and set the compression to BC3 slash DXT5 and then just hit OK. Now close out that and close. So once you've got your custom texture you want to cut that and then go into your data folder and the textures <laughs> and create a new folder with the same name as your ESP so mine will just be custom stuff. <laughs> then for that. And then what you want to do is open up the GAC and make sure you save it to your own ESP so you don't just edit the game itself. Now you want to load all the files. What you want to do is type in first person and then the name of your weapon. Whoops. There we go. There it is. And then put in your own ID and create your own one. Just call it custom weapon again. Create a new form. Then open up that and click edit and then you see this here you'll have to create your own texture set what you want to do is type in first person then the name of your weapon and then texture so once you're in this you want to create your own name for it custom weapon texture and then with this diffuse here you want to edit this and then go into your texture folder and choose that and as you can see it says hey and then click OK create a new form yes there it is there so then now what you want to do is go back to your first person one oops custom weapon there it is here and then click on edit and then double click that and go to your one there it is there and as you can see it says hey So then once you've done that, you want to type in WEP10 and then double click on the weapon. Once it's loaded, you want to give it your own ID, custom weapon, oh. then give it its own name in the game if you want, I'll call this Hey. You can edit the stats, put the damage as 6000. Put the health as 2000. Value 9999. Just for the hell of it. Fire rate, you can edit that. Put this to 5. But then, if you just want to do the texture, then go to Art and Sound. And then, here where it says Model, click Edit on that. And double click this. And then, add your own one. And there it says Hey. And also, what you want to do is click on the first person model object and then choose your own one there. And that should be it. Now, let's go test in game. We'll have to put your gun in game as well, so I'll just choose an interior. Let's go for Doc Mitchell's house in Good Springs. So then you just drag this into here and press F for it to go to the floor. Then hit save. Then we'll see you in game. Once you've opened Fallout Mod Manager, all you want to do is select your ESP and then launch Fallout New Vegas. 
So once you're in the game, all you want to do is find your weapon. And as you can see, you can see the blue mark there, and it says "Hey." So we'll just pick that up and equip it. Well, you can't see it very well. I'll just go into free cam here. And as you can kind of see, there it says hey, but it's covered up by my hand. So that's how you make your own custom texture for Fallout 3 or Fallout New Vegas. Thanks for watching.